Do I take it? I think I take it. Oh my. Crikey, that's a... That's a long ride. What the hell is that? No, it's just one of those dudes with a stick. Cathedral Ward? Oh my gosh, I know where I am. Finally, after all this time, I finally got that item. <laughs> now, the problem is, is that if I drop down, I am a long way from here. Long, long way. So I do not want to drop down. 6,359 blood echoes are not really worth that trouble. So, oh, I finally got that item. <laughs> That's pretty freaking cool, man. Alright, let's take another ride down. Keeping an eye out for secrets. Didn't see any, did you? Okay, now I'm going to do this. There's a secret down there. Whoa. That's a long way down, man. And I can't... doesn't look like there's any passageways that lead anywhere. I'm going to bring this back down just in case I need a quick escape. Just in case. Who knows what else lurks down here. Another one of those weird things that disappear. I don't know what to call it yet. Wow. Okay, I'm, I think... Uh, yeah, maybe not. I was going to say everything's cleared out this way, but maybe not. Because I think this is where... That thing was standing when I came up behind it, right? You remember that? The thing that, that chased me and that I killed with fire through the doorway. There's another mark on a tree there. We came from down there. So... Yeah, okay, we came from there. There's the place with the laughing people. Okay. Man, what are the significance of those guys? I make it all kinds of noise. Madman's knowledge. Look at my insight up there. I'm an insight of 13. I've heard that extra insight makes the game more challenging, but not until you get up around 40 insight. I don't know if that's true or not, but it's one of those things that I read accidentally. Well, let's go this way. What does this have to say? This says, Kin of the Cosmos waits ahead. Therefore, treat insight with care. What the hell does that mean? And what is this um, gesture this guy's doing? What is that? What is that one? What is that called? And why is he doing it? Um. Um. Huh, what's conviction? That's conviction. Okay. Let's see here. Let's um, switch with... Um, I thought I learned a new one. Shake off capes and pray. Okay, no. Huh. I don't know that gesture that that guy just did. Yeah, I don't know that one. Huh. This says... Treat insight with care. Malformed thing waits ahead. What's this business about insights? Why is everybody talking about insight? Malformed thing waits ahead. Well, it's a good day to die. Right, treat insight with care. Beware of terrible foe and treat close range fight with care. What the f? He's 
You're making noises. Remember, sneak attack or fire is effective. Gladly. These you people have freaked me out about this thing, whatever the hell it is. Well, it's dead. I killed it. Is that the thing they were talking about? Is there something else waiting for me down here? Because that wasn't too bad. Quicks over bullets. Fire blood gemstone. That sounds neat. Oh, corruption. Okay. Let's see. Fire, <clears throat> fire blood gemstone. Waning. Most waning blood gems provide rare special effects such as fire, bolt, or healing. So this gives fire attack up 8.4%. Hit points continues to recover plus one. Okay. So uh, I thank you for um, warning me about this. This guy warned me. So I'll give him an appraisal. I can't go in there. I mean, what was, what was, what was that thing? What was so bad about him? Alright, are we going to be able to go into this door? Uh, I thought I found a secret pathway, but I guess I didn't. Let's break all these things. Well, what? This is a dead end? I came all the way here for nothing? What? What is the purpose of this place, then? Is this a door right? No. What? Ah, corruption. Why does it say that? Why did three people decide to raid it? What the hell? Does this thing do something? Doesn't look like it. What is the purpose of this place? There's nothing here. Why is this all steamy? I guess it's somebody just left a note on top of one of the manhole covers. What the hell is the purpose of this place? I mean, I'm, I don't mean just this place, I mean... This whole place. There's nothing down here unless there's another path that I've missed. What? I, why are we here? What is the... What in... What the hell? What? I don't know, man. I feel like I'm missing something. What am I missing, you guys? What is it? I mean, obviously, don't... I mean, if I, if I just flat out didn't see something like a ladder or something, or another pathway, feel free to let me know that. But, don't be too spoilery if it's like, you know, like something that I wouldn't know yet. Huh. Um, I am baffled. Why is this here? I mean, just for that... That blood gem? I mean... I just don't see any reason for this place. Why would I come back here? Why did I come here in the first place? And what's this healing church workshop business? There's a locked door at the very, very top of the tower that I haven't figured out how to open yet, so... I know I'll be going back there at some point, but um, as far as why this place is here, I do not know. Yeah, I'm, I'm not seeing it. I'm just not. And this room over here, where we fought the tall wolf man, 
I can't do anything in this room. Does he have anything new to say? Doesn't sound like it. Night of Curse is a night to remember. So now we're back in Healing Church Workshop, but um, I can't fly, so I can't go back up. Okay, I mean, the only way out of here is up that ladder that takes us back to Cathedral Ward. Uh, okay, well, thanks for visiting. I don't like this at all. This is useless, just a completely useless area. Like some gates up there. <laughs> this guy ran in here. <laughs> well, I don't know what killed him. Huh. Like he uh, was doing a roll and then maybe rolled off the elevator. Alright. Yeah. Well, now I'm back at Cathedral Ward. Yeah. Um. All right. Huh. Uh. So I think what we'll do is I will. Let's just do it. I'm gonna run down here to um the cathedral ward lamp. I don't know if he'll follow me in there or not. Oh man. These guys don't seem to care enough to follow me down here. Stupid bird over there. So, uh... Yeah. Here we are back here again. Here we are back here again. And I'm gonna guess this guy has nothing new to say. Yeah. So, I'm gonna go back to Hunter's Dream. Might as well get something out of these 7,000 blood echoes. Let's go back to Hunter's Dream real quick. So I'm thinking that when we talk to her, she's going to have something to say since we've discovered that other bizarre area. She's going to have to, right? Hello? Hello? Um... Okay. Is she not gonna wake up for us? I don't wanna hit her. Gehrman or whatever his name isn't in here. There's that thing again. out here oh so we have something else we could give to these guys let's 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 give it to them see if they want it messenger urn festival no idea the purpose of this okay so they put stuff on their heads ha 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 oh I don't get it alright uh like nothing going on out here so many questions so few answers. How do I wake her up? Oh, talk. Was that not a, an option before? Ah, welcome home, good hunter. I must have drifted off. What is it you desire? I want you to tell me what the hell's going on around here. Give small hair ornament. Over time, okay. the great old... Well, let's give her this, see what happens. Hopefully nothing terrible. What? What is this? I... I... can't remember. Not a thing, only... I feel... A yearning, something I never felt before. 
What's happening to me? What have we done? <gasps> Tell me, Hunter. Could this be joy? Ah. <sighs> Tearstone. All right. Tearstone. Is it a rune? I mean, a blood gem? It's not. It's not a rune. Tearstone. Tearstone. Silver shining tearstone. Used to gain droplet blood gem. All right. Uh, used to change into a droplet blood gem that fortifies any weapon. A doll sheds neither blood nor tears, and thus its nature remains unknown. Whoever thinks this is precious must be troubled by severe naivete. Whoa. I wonder if this has another use. Welcome, what is it? Over time. Alright, she has nothing new to say. Farewell, good hunter. Whoa. Um, we have a chalice here. A short ritual root chalice is required to conduct a ritual. Use the ritual altar to create a chalice dungeon with a chalice ritual, or to search for chalice dungeons created by hunters in other worlds. Okay. Chalice Ritual. Conduct a Chalice Ritual to create a Chalice Dungeon. Find an accessible Chalice Dungeon. Find a Chalice Dungeon using a Chalice Glyph. We're not going to do that right now. Wow, I could do it in any of these altars? So once I use the Chalice, can I go back in again? Or is that it? I don't know, man. I don't know. So we have all kinds of runes now. How many can we equip? Do we even have any of them equipped right now? We do. We have the air rune equipped, although it doesn't really look like it. Uh, let's see. Higher blood vial maximum. I don't know. Higher quicksilver bullet max. I don't find myself running out of any of the either of these, but I guess if we're allowed to equip more of them, why not? We don't have any oath memories. Visceral attacks grant more blood echoes. Increases defense. I think that might be a good one. I'm going to switch it out for this one. Let's do that. So now we... I don't know why they're not showing up in our little thing over there. Okay. Huh. All right. Alright. Well, there's our Carol Rune effect. More blood echoes from visceral attacks. Max vials held up plus one. Really? Physical damage reduction plus three percent. Okay. Fortify weapon. Uh, we don't have any bloodstone chunks, so we can't do that. But we can upgrade our repeating pistol, so let's go ahead and do that. Okay. And now... We can do some blood gem fortifications. Um, I kind of like what I've got now. Charge attacks. I, I kind of like this just physical attack up plus 7.3%. Physical up at full HP plus 2.7%. Ooh, I could put this in here now. This one does fire attack up 8.4%. Okay, cool. So we'll do that. And then we could also do something with our pistol, I think. Yeah. Oh, we have uh, these two. Oh my gosh, look at this difference. Let's use this blood tinge gemstone instead. Awesome. Okay. And then uh, we're low on the Molotov cocktails, so I'm just going to use these blood echoes to buy more Molotov cocktails. Why are you guys holding all kinds of weapons and books and stuff? Purchase items. Molotov cocktails. I could buy 17 of them. Awesome. Okay, well, it's break time for me. Uh, I'm not sure what I'm going to do next time. Next time, we will either take on Vicar Amelia 
or we'll try out this here chalice dungeon. And I'm actually kind of leaning towards this, so maybe that's what we'll do next. We'll see what this chalice dungeon business is all about. I hope you'll join me. Thank you so much for joining me on this episode. I hope you enjoyed it. If you did, wouldn't you consider leaving a like or a comment? And if you're not a subscriber, please cons consider subscribing. Thank you so much for watching. I hope to see you again in the next episode.